Hello everyone, this is Amar Kumar Ram. Welcome back to my channel. This is a continuation video in the micro front end communication playlist. Till now we have successfully communicated between the remote application and the host application. Let me show you a quick demonstration of that. So this is a remote application where we have this is a remote application label. Then there is a counter value, counter button to increase this counter value and there is a text. So if I click on the counter button, our counter value increases, but it increases the value at the remote side. If I write anything here, it does not do anything at the remote side. But what if when we integrate this remote application with the host application? Let's check in the next tab. So in the host application, we have successfully integrated the remote application as shown till the last video where we have another button at host side with name control MFE counter value. So when we click this button, which is at the host side, then the value of counter will increase at the remote side, which is the communication from host application to the remote application. So when I click on this control MFE counter value button at host side, then the counter value is getting increased at remote side and I can increase this value from the remote button also. So it is a successful implementation of the communication from host to remote side. Now we also implemented a communication from remote to host side. So whatever we type in this input box at the remote side, the same will reflect at the host side at this place. So let's try this. We are writing test and then clicking outside and the same is getting reflected at the host side, which is an example of communication from remote application to the host application. But wait, whatever we have done till now is using the global object, which can be considered as an insecure communication between host and remote application. And many of you have asked me on how to communicate between host and remote with a secured channel. So now here is the time. We are going to learn on how to communicate between host and remote with a secured channel in the coming videos. So let's meet in the next video. Till that, be happy. Take care. Signing off.